This frayer in the middle, what is that? It's just a middle name. Doesn't mean nothing, but it's a commonly trend now to name a person with three names. You know, you always get the last name from your father, but uh, the first two is just mainly out of the blue. And maybe the first name is for your. Uh, I was like named for uh, my grandfather, a uh, grand grandfather, named Stenthor. So if I call you Steine, it's okay. Yeah, I think it's more easy here in Sweden. <laughs> okay. uh, can you describe yourself uh, as a football player? Uh, I'm not very tall, <laughs> but I'm, you know, very aggressive. Uh, always want to win. Uh, I think I got a lot of skills and I got the mentality and yeah I'm, f I'm pretty fast uh, on the first meters and yeah I think it's yeah <laughs> some of that, those recipes is something that uh, you really need so how are you going to show the, the, the public and the players what you are going for just have to show them on the field and when I get the chance to grab it and you know just play from my heart I think. When Swedish football discuss Icelandic football, we all always uh, say that it's very tough, it's a hard game and it goes straight on goal. How do you in, on Iceland describe the Swedish football? Uh, I think it's, you know, we, if you compare it to each other, you know, it's more, more skilled players and, you know, of course everyone in Sweden are uh, mostly are professional. But in Iceland, we we don't uh, describe us as professional, but health professional maybe. But the Swedish is definitely the uh, step you know forward from Iceland. If you just take the history from Iceland and Swedish games, the national team, you should see the difference. I heard also that you were very good in, in handball, and uh, it was very it was a very late decision if you want to play handball or football. Why? Did it become football? I uh, just, you know, I was more fond of the game. Uh, I think, yeah, I'm, I'm, you know, I chose football because I, I want to be the best in football rather than handball. But uh, yeah, I think it's just, yeah, that, that was the decision. I liked it more. What did you know about Örgryte before Dick uh, and Janne was visiting you on Iceland? Didn't know, you know, really much. I just knew it, it was a big club. You have heard, you know, from Iceland about it. And one of my teammates went here on a trial when he was younger. And I knew some Icelandic players has, has, had been here. You know, like Arne Kvjansen and Rune Kristins. So we have a good reputation. Yeah, <laughs> you had a lot of Icelanders, and so this is what you know. I could see myself as one of these players. So I have five questions to you now about Örgryte. Let's see how much you have studied this uh, club now. Uh, the first question is: Which year was Örgryte founded? Okay, I think. Uh, I saw it on a picture when I went down to the cells and it was before Barcelona and I'm gonna guess 1887. That's correct. Oh, okay. Good. <laughs> okay, and the second question is what is the name of uh, Örgryte's uh, home field here in Gothenburg? Uh, Gamle Ulevi. <laughs> correct, good. Uh, third question. Which legendary player re retired last year and became players manager of the Swedish national football team? I will guess Marcus Olpak. He's on all the pitches here, so... <laughs> well, that's correct also. Uh, this one is a little more tricky, I think, for you. But what, which is the last year uh, Örgryte won the SM Trophy? Uh, yeah, it's it's ninety eighty something, eighty five. That's correct. Oh, Good guess. <laughs> <laughs> okay, if you if you can catch this one, I give you a good grade. 
who is the captain of the first team? Yeah, that's the trickiest one. <laughs> uh, it's the beautiful guy in the middle with the hair. <laughs> I don't remember his name. His name is Björn Anklev. Björn Anklev. <laughs> you better listen to him yeah. carefully. <laughs> Björn uh, has a uh, music taste, is uh, uh, rock and roll. What kind of music do you listen on? Same, so we should, you know, get together. <laughs> oh, that's great. And today you're going to make your debut here on Öskorden. It's the uh, under-21 team. Uh, we call it the B team. It's playing against IFK Gothenburg, and you're going to play uh, one half. What can we see about you today? Hopefully, uh, the best thing I can do, you know. Just gonna try to play my football and you know try not to be nervous or anything like that. Just be professional and do what the team needs. You had it, and what the coach want me to do. And what 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 wants the coach you to do? Uh, put a pressure on them if you lose the ball and sort of, and take the initiative when I get the ball. If I'm one against one, do something. And yeah, do my best. <laughs> Are we looking forward uh, to see you on the game? And uh, warm welcome to Ögrytesteina. Yeah, thank you. Thank you.